Philadelphia City Council member Kenyatta Johnson and his wife indicted on federal corruption charges. Those corruption charges were announced late this morning. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Janelle Burrell. And I'm Jim Donovan. Kenyatta Johnson becomes the second sitting council member charged in a federal corruption probe. Eyewitness News reporter Joe Holden is live in Center City, where the U.S. attorney laid out the case against Johnson and the other defendants. Good afternoon, Joe. Jim Janelle, good afternoon. Plain and simple, it is alleged Councilman Kenyatta Johnson used his official position on Philadelphia City Council to benefit a company that prosecutors say had financial ties to Kenyatta Johnson's wife's consulting business. There are other players connected to this 22 count indictment. Some of those folks are charged with racketeering. We underscore Councilman Johnson and his wife Dawn Chavu are not facing racketeering charges. The U.S. Attorney's Office making this announcement this morning at a news conference. This makes for the second sitting councilman charged by federal prosecutors. Court records claim Kenyatta, Kenyatta Johnson used what's known as councilmatic prerogative. That is a controversial custom among city council members to leverage control over all development projects in their districts. It is alleged by prosecutors the councilman introduced and voted on spot zoning legislation related to the Royal Theater, a property formerly held by University the company at the center of the scheme and in addition the councilman is accused of blocking reversion of another property held by the same company after it failed to develop that parcel of land. Prosecutors say Johnson was paid more than $66,000. The payments it's claimed were diverted through his wife Dawn Chavu's consulting company. Here is assistant U.S. attorney Jennifer Williams. Defendant Kenyatta Johnson is the Philadelphia City Councilman for the 2nd District. He is charged in this indictment with two counts of honest services wire fraud arising from the allegation that he performed official actions in exchange for corrupt payments. His wife Dawn Chavu was also charged in this scheme with two counts of honest services wire fraud. She operates Chavu Consulting and she is charged with having entered into a sham consulting agreement in order to receive the, the corrupt payments for her husband, the city councilman. Councilman Johnson did release a statement last evening and it still stands according to a spokesman. Let me quote here. First, let me be clear. I am innocent. I did nothing wrong. I am the victim of overzealous federal prosecutors who have spent the last five years looking for something to charge me with. If charged with any crime, I will be pleading not guilty. Johnson and his wife Don Chavu expected to make their first appearance here at the federal courthouse on Friday afternoon for arraignment. Now, if convicted as charged, both Johnson and his wife could face a number of 40 years in prison. The councilman has scheduled a four o'clock news conference to confront these allegations. We're back at four with the latest and of course the full story at cbsphilly.com. But for now, live at federal court in Center City, I'm Joe Holden, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Thank you, Joe.